Gentlemen, I represent Ukrainian national team of higher education reform experts, and I am working in Odessa National Maritime Academy. I would like to bring your attention to uh, one more site of collaboration with business, uh, of collaboration uh, of higher educational institutions and business, collaboration with a view of improving employability of graduates. In this context, I'd like fo uh, to focus. Uh, I'd like to focus uh, on practical steps for ach towards achieving. Uh, towards achieving grad by graduates predefined standards of competencies. Uh, this will be presented on the base of experience of Odessa National Maritime Academy, only one institution. But first of all, some words about our institution. Here is a map of Europe and Ukraine. At uh, on the map, and here is location of Odessa National Maritime Academy. Some basic facts of, uh, uh, about our academy uh, now presented at the screen. Academy provides study programs uh, at all uh, degrees of higher education that, uh, that accepted in European higher education area and established in Ukraine. Uh, our degrees from short cycle of higher education up to two levels of uh, doctorate programs. When we are think, when we think about long-term partnership with business uh, as important priority of our institution, we are thinking about main objectives: quality of study programs and quality of qualification, and linking link it with uh, this employability of graduates. In, uh, in this context, I would like to define some uh, elements of collaboration with business. First of all, uh, uh, it is a study program development, also practical training for students, development of technical base, tutors professional development, development as and result, improving employability of graduates. Sorry. One slide back. <laughs> Is it possible one slide back? <laughs> uh -huh. Thank you. Here is diagram uh, that illustrates the process of uh, development of uh, study program and uh, curriculums. In the interest of time, I will not describe all this uh, diagram. I will uh, only say that uh, each study program uh, includes mandatory part and elective part. Uh, business have a good possibilities for including. Uh, their specific requirements and specific subjects into curricula, into elective parts of curricula uh, by using direct contact with institution. Uh, here is uh, two different elective parts presented. These elective parts uh, are the parts of uh, program of study in the field of navigation. Uh, each of uh, these parts have 11 ECTS points, but have uh, different sets of subjects. Uh, first of uh, this part, uh, of these parts uh, is created in accordance with requirements of uh, Ukrainian Danube shipping company, and uh, another one is created with, in accordance with the requirement of different dredging companies. Uh, another important element of uh, collaboration of our institution with business is uh, providing practical training for students. For students. Uh, some general facts. Uh, Academy has more than 150 agreements concerning students' practical training, and including 16, uh, 16 agreements for students' training and, uh, and sponsorship. Uh, in accordance to these agreements, uh, companies take uh, responsibility for 
providing for each student transfer, including flights, accommodation, salary, opportunities for fulfillment and completion of training programs, and supervision of training process. For uh, here is a list of leading companies that uh, provide uh, training for most of our students. Uh, we see that some of them, uh, of these companies, uh, are company registered in Ukraine, and other uh, com other companies are foreign companies. Uh, in, with the aim of supervision of practical training, each company appoints uh, company training officers and ship training officers. A ship training officer instructs and manages students during, during uh, practice. Ship training officers control completion of training program and inspect and sign, sign training record book. Company training officers inspect and certify training record book. Uh, training record book is important instrument for practical training and after uh, program after uh, training program completion training record books is a documentary evidence of completion of these programs and some picture that illustrate what is the training record book here is uh, the page with infor information on students the page uh, where uh, company training officer safety certify completion of training programs uh, uh, training program and uh, a page uh, where ship training officer certify completion of each task of each mandatory operation. Another element of collaboration with uh, business is development of technical base. With this aim, companies create and sponsor modern labs and simulators. Here is uh, as a, now at the screen a list of labs and simulators that was sponsored by uh, leading shipping companies, uh, one, uh, some of them Ukrainian and another foreign shipping companies. And some pictures that illustrate uh, uh, these simulators at, la at labs. For example, Navy Trainers Professional, sponsored by company V Ships Ukraine, uh, lab Laboratory of Automation, Electrotechnic labor Laboratory, Multimedia English Laboratory, and Full Mission Bridge Simulator. All these laboratories and simulators are not cheap. Uh, for uh, as example, the price of uh, last uh, simulator presented at last picture, full mission bridge simulator, is more than uh, than 100,000 uh, US dollars. One more important uh, element of collaboration is tutors professional development. development. Uh, with uh, for this purpose, the companies. Uh, partners companies organize uh, joint research seminars and conferences provide update programs for tutors on of the company's base give free access to the company's libraries and organize coordinated with academy on job training for tutors and what are the motivation at motivations at what are the advantages for company and for institution, especially for companies. Why companies spend money, spend uh, spends, uh, their resources? Uh, for companies that are shipping company, company, companies is employing, uh, the main advantage, advantage is employing qualified graduates. It is impossible for shipping company, company to employ unqualified graduates because of strong international uh, regulations and uh, strong safety requirements. But for the company that are not shipping company, uh, for company that is producers of, uh, producer of equipment, main advantage in my vision is promoting the company brand, brand through study process. Uh, graduates very good know and ready to use company equipment in their future professional activities. Uh, as an uh, example of partners, uh, the second part of uh, these companies, uh, companies uh, that are producers of equipment, I can uh, say uh, Mitsubishi Electric, Schneider Electric, uh, and uh, Phoenix Contact, uh, all of them are foreign company. 
and uh, advantages for institutions are traditional. Modern facilities, study programs are linked to modern requirements, professional development for tutors and graduates meet professional standards and companies' requirements. And as a result, high level employability of graduates. Most of them are employed by companies where they had practical training. And uh, one more aspect of collaboration, what we have to take into account when we think about possibilities of support from business. First of all, it is situation in relevant sector of economy and linked with this current and perspective sector needs in graduates. This diagram shows that during years of from 2008 till 2010, as a result of the crisis, the shipping was lowering and number of students uh, of positions for stu trainings for students on board was lowering also. From years of 2011, shipping goes up and number of places for students, for practice of students, is goes up also. And another important influencing uh, factors, uh, factors in my vision. Compliance of study program with professional standards and business requirements, involving companies in teaching and students assessment, quality and quality of learning outcomes, and linking with this regulation, uh, reputation of graduates and reputation of educational institutions. And one more aspect in my vision is uh, very important. Uh, for good reputation of educational institution, it is very important to have independent recognition by, by authoritative professional institution. And as an example, I'd like to present some certificate, certificates of recognition, uh, uh, certificates of recognition uh, issued for our academy. Uh, here is accreditation certificates of the Institute of Marine Engineering, Science and Technology of the United Kingdom. Uh, these certificates issued for bachelor courses and master courses. According, in according, according to these certificates, our graduates can be registered uh, as incorporated engineer or chartered engineer by Engineering Council of the United Kingdom. And another certificate is the Certificate of Nautical Institute of the United Kingdom. Uh, these certificates make uh, better possibilities for our graduates to be employed as inside Ukraine, as uh, so outside Ukraine, in any shipping company over all the world. I think it was my last slide. I'd like say thank you for attention and I hope uh, I have not over time yes <laughs>